Hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm calling a timeout here. Let's talk about this. While we have made changes in the classroom here at Northwestern for the safety of our students, we must also address the changes that we are making outside of the classroom. While this used to be our typical Friday night normal, because of the pandemic, our Friday nights are going to look a little bit different this year. My name is Joshua Hunia, Teacher of the Year here at Northwestern, and I am here to give you the 411 on Friday nights at D3 so you don't end up with a penalty flag. Let's review some film. So the game plan for Friday night starts with acquiring your tickets for entry. Tickets will be sold online only at northwesterntrojans.org. To make sure you get past the line of scrimmage without an offsides, make sure to get your tickets early and secure your entry into the stadium. When arriving at D3 Stadium, fans are to park their cars in the designated parking areas as always. However, this year, we are encouraging fans to remain in their cars until the gates open at 6.30, refraining from any social activity and congregating prior to the game. Attempts to congregate, tailgate, or enter the stadium early will be met with a false start penalty. So let's make sure to keep all the activity inside the stadium at game time. Our players can't play without proper equipment, and our fans need proper equipment too. This year, we will continue to enforce the clear bag policy set forth by the Rock Hill School District, and we will be requiring all attendants of the game to wear a mask. To avoid an equipment violation, please wear your mask and follow all district policies. And also, don't forget it, because once you leave the stadium, you will not be allowed back in. Last year, as you can see, we went with the tight block style formation. However, with social distancing in the huddle, we have to call an audible and switch to the spread formation for our spectators. Our guests this year can ensure that they are socially distant by sitting on the green dots located throughout the stadium. And for our student section, they can sit on the blue dots, which are spaced six feet apart and allow for at most six students per row. Remaining socially distant will keep everyone safe and make sure that you are not caught with an illegal formation penalty. We understand that our spectators want that up close and personal sideline view of the game. However, for the protection of our players and coaches, we are asking that fans do the following. Do not hang on the fence or congregate in areas in front of the fence. These areas should only be used to move about the stadium. If you were caught hanging on the fence or congregating in areas in front of the fence, you could receive an illegal motion violation along with a holding call. And also, to avoid an offsides, we ask that fans not attempt to enter the field or sideline at any point during the game. For the safety of our players, the only people allowed on the field will be coaches and administrators. Now we here at Northwestern understand that two other aspects that come along with Friday night football are food and family. This year, we are tackling COVID-19 at the concession stands by only offering our guests pre-packaged food. We are also encouraging Trojan parents to monitor their tinier Trojans. Students who are in the elementary school or middle school levels should also be supervised to make sure they are staying safe. Thank you for taking the time to watch through this video. We look forward to seeing you on Friday nights and want to encourage you to follow us on Twitter at NHS Trojans for more athletic updates. Stay safe, see you soon, and as always, go Trojans.